Okay, good afternoon everyone, or evening, whatever time of day you're watching this video. It's Hans Last here with another video. This is going to be a short video. Today I'm going to demonstrate something called the abacus, which is what we use. This is the abacus for the blind abacus. Okay, I'm going to... Uh... Okay, so this is the abacus here. Let me just adjust the lighting here. So, this is an abacus. And no, it does not look like those fancy Chinese abacus that you may have seen on, from China or whatever. This is what especially, well, I don't know if it's specially made, but something that the, we would blind people would use. We would learn in school back in the day. It was mathematics. So basically, how it is is there's um, you can tell it's it's like had it like thirty some years had it since the nineteen eighties. I don't know exactly when I got it, but there's some raised lettering. I don't even know what it is, but um, I don't think that's relevant. Well, I don't know about, about it, but anyway, it's all black and then it's got beads. Now. Here's how the layout is. It's from, um, normally you would think it's from right to left, right? Or le left to right. Well, it's actually left to right. Um, so, we basically learned it. Um, so, it was units. Okay, so here are the color. Anyway, like the four beads on the bottom. And then there's those single beads across the top. They represent five. So, the four beads, so... Here we are. So we always learned the rhyme in school, in the third grade, actually. So this is the abacus. And in the middle bar is called the stop. And then there's tactile buttons, or well, tactile markings. There's some of them are faded off here. And of course, on the bottom, too, to, fa to find where we are, too, there's like units, tens, hundreds, thousands, ten thousand, hundred thousand, million, ten million, one hundred million. Um, um, billion, one hundred, ten billion, one hundred billion, trillion. So yes. So anyway, okay. Now I don't know. Don't ask me why they did it because typically on the paper you'd write right to left. But anyway, so anyway, left to right. Sorry, pardon me. I'm all confused here. I'm here in Western culture. Okay, so anyway. The units were here, so starting at the units, so we count number one would be one bead. So uh, two, three, and then four. Okay, so now, so if we could do the number five, we, we push the five bead down. So now you can see that one bead down. So the number five bead is five. So six, seven, eight, nine. So, okay. So, now, what we would do is we would take away the number, so ten, and we would repeat the numbers. Any, and then, so, like, just up ten. So, that would be twenty. So, the number twenty. So, number twenty-three would look like this. And the number twenty-five would look like that. Like the two and the five. Okay, so. So now I'm going to do. Um, all right, number 2021. Okay, so now I'm, I'm just going to do it this way. So number. So I'm just going to pick a random number here. Three, seven. Five. So that. So there you go. Three. No. Okay. I've got. Okay. So I've got three hundred seventy. Like you have the the five and the two, which makes seven and five. Okay. So there's number three hundred seventy-five. So I think you get the gist. So okay. So that was just putting numbers on here. So now addition and subtraction. Okay. Um, now that's it because it's been years since I've done this. So. Um, all right, so I'm going to do 20, f so I'm going to do um, a simple calculation. I'm going to do 15, 
So there you go, 15 plus 30, 33. Okay, I'm going to do 15 plus 32. So 15. So we add 32. So there's the number 47. So 47. And yes, there's a lot of fingers there because that is how a blind person feels. Okay, so. All right, so there's the 47. And uh, my apologies. So, okay. So now for subtracting. I'm going to take away 23. So I take away the 2, like so. Now for 3. So now there's 7. So what I do is clear 5 and add 1. Or is that? No. Okay, so it's 7. So take away 3. So clear 5, set 2. Okay. All right. So there's your answer, 24. Okay. So that's basically how it works, or an idea. Okay, so there's the number 24. Okay, so now don't ask me to do multiplication because I honestly have trouble remembering that. So anyway, um, multiplication and division is complicated because, I, you know, it's been so long since I, ever, I um, forgot because it was the late 1980s I started using calculators. So, but that gives us a basic idea. So let me think here. I'm going to try something here. All right. I'm going to do um, a simple. Uh, okay. So I'm going to do. Uh, actually, I don't know if I'm going to be. And, and, you know, it's bad since we don't know. It's been years and it's been so long since I've used this for that. Now, I don't really use it anymore. But what I do use it for is for putting numbers on. Like just if I have a long number, like I'm going to, okay, now in that part, as far as I do, I do use numbers because it's from left, I mean, yeah, it's from left to right. So it gets more familiar. So I, 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 I disregard the columns. So, um, so I'm going to sh show how I put a phone number on here. Ideally, it would be... Um, Okay, because it doesn't matter because units and digits. So ideally what I do, for example, I'm going to do, um, um, just going to do the generic, what they do on the movies, 555, five, five, um, uh, 1212. Two. So there's 555121212. Five, one, two, one, two, one, two. That's why I put a phone number on here. Okay, so that's um, that's how we just do a, a simple number. So um, so if we just do a toll-free number, I'm just going to make up one here for, for for demonstration purposes here. So let's do eight zero zero. So a zero, we just leave it blank. Um, uh, two three one. Um, two, 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 two. Okay. Now I don't know also what that number is, but that's just a hypothetical number. So here we go. So it's eight zero zero two three one two 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 two. Okay. So that's how we just ha that's how we do phone numbers. Uh, okay. And um, so. I have it so we clear. So that's just kind of an ab how an abacus is used. And the zoom numbers, what I do, of course, it's a thirteen. It's an eleven-digit number. I'm just gonna I'm, I'm just gonna plug a random number here. Um, three, four, six, um, two, one, two, seven, eight. One zero six. Now this is just a random zoom number. Okay. Now notice it uses eleven of the thirteen columns. Okay. So again, 
the left to right illustration, we've got just a hypothetical Zoom um, conference ID, like a Zoom ID, meeting ID. We got three, four, six, uh, two, one, two, seven, uh, eight, one, zero, uh, six. So again, zero is represented by just leaving the beads clear. Okay? Alrighty. There you have just a basic idea of an abacus that is used for the blind. And so there it is again, the abacus. And that is that is that. So, with that, we thank everyone for watching this abacus demo.